So one thing currently making so many rounds all over the internet happens to be the protest made by some Zimbabweans that the August election was actually rigged and of course coupled to that they want to believe that the president, President Emerson Nangagwa isn't supposed to be there or isn't supposed to be the president but all the same it's almost like we're still waiting on the SADC to like tell us if at all they've endorsed the elections or maybe something still has to be done to like double check but we're getting information right now from Zimbabwe's former deputy prime minister professor Artu Mutambara uh, and of course he's making us to understand that SADC is not coming to save Zimbabweans well if you're stopping for the very first time hit that subscribe button hit the bell notification button and please do not forget to also share this video to your friends and family well in a short retort uh, the former deputy prime minister said that is that zimbabweans must create the good news and of course if at all they desire good things they must actually bring it to themselves well in this particular short statement that was made by this man it was captioned with something like this sadc intervention matter is a closed chapter Nothing is coming from SADC. If folks are looking for good news, they must go and create the good news. The relevance of SADC on the Zimbabwe elections ended when President Sir Maposa congratulated the Muslim Nangagwa and attended that inauguration. That was the end of the discussion of SADC doing anything on the subject. Was that not obvious? Zimbabweans must stop raising the SADC name with respect to the 23rd August 2023 elections. It is pathetic. We must be our own liberators. Forget SADC. That is what he said. Well, to make everything clean and clear, this particular man wants us to understand that SADC is not coming to double check whatsoever results or to say anything to the president, Emerson Nangagwa, but rather they've endorsed everything already and everything is in motion. That's to say, Nangagwa still has his term of office in place. Well, he still reiterated that if things want to get better, then Zimbabweans must look for their own freedom and look for their own liberation. What's your take concerning this video? Leave your thoughts right down in the comment section.